The COVID-19 pandemic causes distress around the world, and the Gambia is of no exception. While examining the mental health situation in the Gambia, the head of the psychiatric department at the Banjo Polyclinic, Dr. Pedro Hernandez, spoke on the challenges faced with mental health patients regarding the pandemic. Not easy that the pandemic increase at least in our patient because as you know our patient is a special patient because they are different than the one because his mind is not properly and sometimes the behavior is not properly neither mm -hmm. so our work in that case uh, we need to accuracy observation all the time Tanka Tanka being the only psychiatric hospital in the country, the psychiatric nurse and matron of the hospital, Omar Bojang, dilates on the risks at hand dealing with patients during the pandemic. Working here comes with its own risk, physically, obviously. But now with this coming of the COVID-19, the risks are even more greater. Me and you, we can talk to each other and say, wear your masks, give, let's make social distancing and other things. But obviously, if a person is admitted here, basically it means the person is not fit to be in the society, mentally unstable. That means simple commands like this will be difficult for them to adhere to. So basically, whenever they are coming here, we are not that well equipped to be testing them first for COVID before we put them into the general public. So we basically look for some basic signs, like if there is fever and all this stuff, if at all it's the, the symptoms are alarming, then we test for rapid, rapid diagnosis test for COVID. We do those ones. The World Health Organization, together with partners, is committed to providing guidance and advice for health workers and people in the communities to help them manage the mental health patients at this critical time. Sainabu Jang for GRTS News.